here I'm doing plate conditioning on a new uh, setup that I'm working on. This one has 12 plates in it. Uh, I realize they're awfully close together, but I wanted to see how it reacts to being so close together. Uh, the point here though is I'm doing uh, <clears throat> conditioning and as you can see I'm only about 10 minutes into it and there's almost no production. There's a half a teaspoon of uh, sodium hydroxide in here. Uh, it should be bubbling a lot better than this. Um, but we'll see how she looks in a couple hours. Now well, this is uh, plate conditioning after about I think about six hours. There's a little bit of foam on top. I'm seeing light uh, light bubble activity. Uh, the color has started to turn a little bit brown. And I think based on uh, the activity, um, these plates are too close together. I'm going to have to make an adjustment there. Now this is the particulate after doing plate conditioning for about oh, 24 to 30 hours. Now with this number of plates it never really got good gas production or very hot. But uh, there's the particulate and there's my finger next to it. Probably looking at about a quarter of an inch in the bottom. And this was with sodium hydroxide. And uh, I think I used about one teaspoon to the gallon. So that's the results of plate conditioning. I probably could do it one more 24 hour stint just to make sure that everything is fine. Um, I don't see any real evidence of a patina on the plates. I mean there's some but it's minor. Therefore I'm going to rebuild these plates and do it again. Give it another good plate conditioning.